Recording 4.4. Dave, have you ever played an April Fool's Day joke on anyone? Um, no, not really. But my brother Alan told me a great story about a practical joke from his university days. He went to、uh, Bristol, didn't he? Actually, it was Birmingham. That's right. I knew it began with B. When was he there? This was back in the mid eighties. Oh right. Anyway, this story happened during Rag Week. You know, when students do all sorts of silly things to raise money for charity, like、uh, race each other down the main street on beds or walk around the streets in strange costumes collecting money or whatever. Yeah, I know what you mean. We have the same sort of thing in Ireland. Well, one day Alan and his two flatmates were woken up at 7 a.m. by the sound of workmen drilling the road outside their house. Oh no! Yeah, what a nightmare. Apparently, they'd all been to a big party the previous night and had got to bed at about 4:30. So they didn't.、Um, they weren't too happy about being woken up first thing in the morning. Yes, I can imagine. So what did they do? Well, one of Alan's flatmates went out to a payphone across the road and called the police. Really? What did he say? According to Alan, his friend told the police that some university students were digging up the road outside their house. You know, as a rag week stunt. You're joking? No, really. He said that the students were dressed as workmen from the local council and asked the police to come round and make them stop. Obviously, he、um, he gave a false name and house number. Right. Meanwhile, Alan's other flatmate went out to tell the workmen that some students dressed as policemen were going round telling people what to do as part of a rag week stunt. So what happened? Well, about ten minutes later, two policemen turned up and told the workmen to stop drilling, obviously because they、um, they thought they were students, and of course the workmen just ignored them because they thought the policemen were students too. <laughs> what a great idea! Yeah, I know. In the end, they managed to work out what had happened and realised they were all victims of a practical joke. Apparently, they thought it was quite funny. And、um, what about Alan and his friends?、Uh, they were all secretly watching the whole thing from their window. Alan said it was absolutely hilarious. I bet it was. Luckily, nobody ever found out who'd called the police. Otherwise, they'd have、um, they'd have been in big trouble. That's a brilliant story. Yes, it is, isn't it? <laughs> oh, by the way, have you heard from Sally recently? She lives in Birmingham now, doesn't she? Yeah, she does. Although、um, we haven't been in touch for a while, I think she's still working at the same place. But.